but declares hope you're all healthy and happy today i'm going to make kottayam fish curry this dish originates from south kerala in india it's a spicy dish in which fish pieces are cooked with shallots curry leaves spices and fish tamarind also called kodambuli and these are cooked in coconut oil earthen pot or man chatti is used to prepare this dish and it usually tastes better the next day so let's begin you would need the following ingredients around 7 pieces of cleaned fish i'm using pompre today 10 to 15 red onions or shallots green chilies according to taste 1 tablespoon ginger 5 to 6 garlic thinly sliced 1/4 teaspoon fenugreek seed half teaspoon turmeric powder 2 and a half tablespoon kashmiri chili powder salt to taste half teaspoon mustard seeds a pinch of fenugreek powder 2 to 3 kodambuli or fish tamarind 2 to 3 tablespoons coconut oil lots of curry leaves and a small pinch of sugar soak the kodambuli in half cup of water for 15 minutes in a manchatti add coconut oil and when it gets hot add mustard seeds when the mustard seeds crackle add fenugreek seeds and saute for few seconds on medium flame now add the red onions chopped ginger chopped garlic green chilies and curry leaves saute the onions till they turn golden brown add the kashmiri chilli powder turmeric powder and cook until the raw smell of the spices goes away and the masala becomes darker in color add kodambuli soaked in water plus 1 1/4 cup water and salt cover and cook for few minutes now taste the gravy and if you find it too sour remove one of the kadambulis once the gravy comes to a boil add the fish pieces cover and cook 8 to 10 minutes on medium flame After 10 minutes add the fenugreek powder and a pinch of sugar and stir gently Cook the gravy for another 2 to 3 minutes until the gravy thickens Kottayam fish curry is ready to serve. This is a delicious dish and it goes perfectly with red rice and also tapioca. Do try this dish at home and if you like it please click subscribe and the like button. Hope this dish tickles your taste buds. Thanks for watching and bye bye.